Well, it's a plan to give food trucks some guidance, but not everyone serving out of a window is happy about it. A new ordinance proposed at last night's Spokane City Council meeting would regulate cooking on the corner. And KXY 4's Ian Cole working for you now to explain how it could affect your favorite food. Ian? That's right, Nadine. Food trucks are popping up all over Spokane, like here at Sunset Boulevard in Government Way with Big Red's Chicago-style cuisine. Uh, just about two weeks ago, there's a big food truck rally. A dozen of them showed up. Now city leaders proposing changes that these food truck owners say they both like and really don't like. KXOY4 brought you problems food trucks and carts were facing more than a year ago. I think they need to get together some sort of packet that has all the questions that you would have and the right answers. Since then, the city conducted a study with leaders, planners, and truck owners. The results, a new city ordinance proposed for the first time this week. One major change, the 10-minute rule. Technically, trucks can only stay in one place for 10 minutes, though it's not often enforced. The ordinance would allow for as long as the meter's limit. And we wanted to make sure our rules uh, accommodated that industry. And truck owners would also have to get permission from the business they're parked in front of, even if it's a city spot. Today, if a mobile food vendor parks in front of a business and the business owner doesn't like having the food truck there, they can ask them to move. The ordinance would change that, a positive for truck owners so that situation won't arise. But it would also add a $40 application fee for oversight and $10 fee for each location they want to set up. Even though Big Red Chicago style cuisine is locked down at Government Way and Sunset Boulevard, owner Curtis Bittner doesn't agree with the added costs. I pay a $380 permit per year, plus I have to pay for all my business licenses through Washington State. You know, all that adds up. You know, and if they want more, it's never going to stop. Uh, the ordinance would also add fees depending on the size of the food truck. The Spokane City Council holding public comment on this at their meeting. That's next Monday at 6 p.m. at City Hall. Reporting live in Spokane, Ian Cole, KXOY4 News.